subungual exostoses arise under the nail bed of the great toe, usually in the second decade, and they may be painful. Incidentally, when I was 19, I had an ingrowing toenail of my big toe, and the cause of this was a subungual exostosis. Subungual exostoses may resemble osteochondromas because they have a cartilaginous cap and a bony stalk. And sometimes they are black and clinically the differential diagnosis would be a melanoma. Histological features of subungual exostoses include cellular hyaline cartilage, areas of ossification with woven bone maturing into lamella bone and loose intertrabecular tissue containing spindle cells. Here is a low power view of a subungual exostosis. At the top of the picture is the hyaline cartilaginous cap. and Below this it is forming bone. Here you can see the bony trabeculae within the subungual exostosis rimmed by osteoblasts. And between the trabeculae there is loose connective tissue containing spindle cells.